Heart of Darkness is a short novel by Joseph Conrad. In fact, it is so short you could finish reading it in just a few hours. But don't take the shortness for simplicity. This is a real meaningful novel that describes the European colonization and exploitation of Africa in late 19th century. The story is about Charles Marlowe, a sailor and adventurer who pulls some strings and becomes in charge of a small steamboat and travels through the Congo River into the heart of the region. As Marlowe and his men travel deeper and deeper into Congo, they hear rumors about this other man named Kurtz who works for a Belgian company that trades in ivory. Kurtz has quite a respectable reputation, not just because he collects a lot of ivory, but also because he spreads the European culture and civilization in this particular region of Africa. In fact, Kurtz appears to be a role model and represents liberty, democracy and civilization. But as Marlowe and his men continue their travel into the uncharted core of Africa, the book becomes much more dark and brutal, and they discover that Kurtz is not the man they expected. In fact, he turns out to be a cruel tyrant who presents himself as a god and is worshipped by the local tribes. So the book really lives up to its title. Now back in 1902, this was one of the first books that exposed the truth about European colonization of Africa and how the Europeans were actually exploiting the resources of the region rather than developing it. But aside being a history-based novel, it is also a mature and dark adventure. But even more importantly, Heart of Darkness is really about the human condition. And this is what really makes the novel distinctive from other books. Conrad's slow, subtle writing style describes how humans, even the best of us, can change our values over time and over environments. Even the best of men can be corrupted. And that is what the novel is really about. Human corruption. It's about how the pursuit of wealth and power poisons our values and how this corruption spreads as a contagious disease, infecting the hearts and minds of every man, woman and child, regardless of ethnicity and religion. It's about how unlimited power breeds unlimited corruption, how the hearts of men grow cold and dark as they attain more and more power. And it all begins not with one single catastrophe, but with an enduring whisper. Heart of Darkness has inspired many other novels and even movies. One particular film adaptation based on this story is Apocalypse Now from 1979. The essence of the story is the same, but it's set during the Vietnam War. And with so many ongoing conflicts throughout the world today, the essence of Heart of Darkness can be applied to every conflict zone. It is easy to get lost in the numbers and statistics, and it is easy to neglect the human condition. The reality is that corruption is everywhere. It is part of the fabric of societies, economies, and politics. Corruption thrives during a crisis or conflict situation, and with so much going on in the world, this book is more relevant today than ever before. So if you like what you hear, you may want to check out this novel. Anyway, my name is Shirvan. Take care and so on.